Question 7. The diagram, drawn on centimetre grid, is an accurate net of a triangular prism. Work out the volume of the prism. So, I'm going to draw a little diagram of this prism. And in the formula sheet, it gives you the formula to work out the prism. It's the cross section, area of the cross section times the length. So, in this case, the cross section is the triangle that I'm shading in blue, which has a height of 4 centimeters and the base is 3 centimeters. So, I'm going to find that area first. So, half times base times height. So half times base, which is 3, times height, which is 4. Oops, let me rub that out. I meant to put 4 in there. So the height's 4. So the area of that triangle is 6 centimeters squared. Okay. So, we found the front, the cross section, the area of the cross section. Now into times it by the length, which is that bit. Okay, and looking on our net, it's that bit. So, by counting the squares, centimeter squares, that's the length is seven centimeters. So, we're going to do the cross section, area of the cross section, times by the length. So, area of the cross section is 6, so the volume is 6 times by 7. So, the volume is 42 centimeters cubed. Just going to paste in what you get in the formula book, uh, the sheet in front of your um, exam. So the cross section times the length. Now, question seven is worth four marks. You get one mark for working out the area of the cross section, one mark for timesing it by the length, one mark for getting 42 and one mark for the units, centimetres cubed.